Hi, if you liked our introductory video on Leonardo today, I would like to suggest an overview of Leonardo's IoT service. Internet of Things consists in a technology that provides real-time information to various applications from intelligent objects. These objects can be almost anything. They could be buildings, manufacturing equipment, vehicles, even people. Why do we describe them as being intelligent? Simply because they are equipped with sensors such as temperature, level, geolocation, etc. One of the most common architectures part of an IoT scenario is to feed data collected by these sensors to local gateway, which role is to validate, sort, aggregate these data, or trigger events. Then, all these items are routed to Leonardo's IoT services. From there, I use that data in my application, analyze it, and eventually act in response to the reported event. To better understand, let's use an example to illustrate what IoT is. I work in a plant where we make ice cream. Through sensors, I get a real-time monitoring of the raw material levels in the tanks. Based on production forecasts, the system can automatically trigger a request for replenishment. The balance of the production is then ensured by vibration sensors that alert me of the equipment's abnormal behaviors, which allow me to take action before the equipment breaks down. As far as the quality of my product is concerned, it is controlled throughout the process. Anomalies regarding such criteria as texture, color, homogeneity are detected by a camera acting as a sensor. Thus, I am quickly informed of batches to be monitored. In my example, IoT is used to different ends, which allowed me to improve my productivity level, reduce maintenance costs, and ensure maximum customer satisfaction. IoT, as explained in today's example, is already being used in some SAP's applications. Note that you can also create custom applications using the same technology. In future videos, I'll have the pleasure to tell you more about other SAP Leonardo components.